record this meeting. Welcome, everybody. So glad you could be on this call tonight. I know we had a lot of people that uh, were, were, are working right now or can't be on the call uh, for one reason or another, but that's why we're recording. And so welcome, you guys. <clears throat> the, the, um, the first thing I want to do is welcome Kayla and Dawn. They're brand new coaches, and they're on our call tonight, so I'm really excited to have them on here tonight. And um, you guys on this call are, are coaches that this business matters to you. So that's why you're on this call. It, this matters to you. And Andrea and I have been, been here for three years and um, we, it matters to us. So we, we want to pull you guys in with us. <clears throat> um, Andrea's actually the coach who signed me up and Don signed Andrea up. So we're all sort of like, we all sort of like started together, even though I didn't do anything with this business for about the first four or five months that I was a coach because I didn't know what to do and we were floundering. <laughs> so now that the training is like incredible now, the trainings are so much better. The training that I'm running with Bonnie Scharf and Julie Miller um, is a brand new type of training. And so the, some of you guys are on that training and it's really, um, they're going to have a lot of fun with it. It's different. We're running it sort of like a diamond dash type training. So first of all, I want to talk a little bit about the, the on-demand uh, stuff that we're doing through Beachbody now. So as you all know, you have to be a club member to get the on-demand package. Um, if you all have not seen the on-demand package, let me know because I thought I would do a screen share. So wave at the screen if you have not seen it. Are you guys all club members and you've got to kind of played around with it a little bit? Yeah? Good. All right, and I did a video, a little video on how to do it, how it works, but it's pretty incredible, and I played around with it and found that it's very easy to use. Andrea, yeah, it's very easy to use. She's used it. <clears throat> Lindsay, have you played around with it a little bit? Yeah, okay, good. It is easy to use, and it's, um, it's cool because you can choose the program you want, or you can choose by trainer or you can choose by um, type of workout, like how long you want the workout, if you want a cardio workout, if you want a strength training workout, or you can, um, you know, you've got a number of ways you can choose your workout. When you choose the program, you also get every single workout in that program, so it's listed out for you. You can pick the program you want. Um, you also get the meal planning, uh, the, the nutrition guide that comes with that program. You get any of the sheets, the uh, tally sheets that come with that program. So you can keep yourself on task. So anything that you would get in a package from Beachbody with the DVDs, you get online, on demand. <clears throat> so if your customer has that program or has that on demand uh, streaming, if they don't renew the next 90 days, then they don't have it anymore. So I'm going to guess that $38.87 every 90 days is not a whole lot of money for most people to spend. It's 44 cents a day. If people are asking you, oh, wow, I don't want to spend $38.87, you can, you can pretty much guarantee that they're thinking, oh, that's a monthly charge. No, that's 90 days. That's for three months. So it's a little bit. Um, it's, it's a little bit, um, under $3 a week. So it's two ninety nine a week, 44 cents a day, very cheap. <clears throat> and I don't know why anybody would not want to do that. So if you, um, if you want, I'll post the video of, of, um, my little, um, video that tells how to do it. It's a little tutorial and I can post that on our page. If you guys want to uh, share it with your customers, you can do that. Or feel free to make one yourselves because I want to encourage you guys to make videos. Yeah, because they're fun. Videos are great. <clears throat> and I'm going to, I really do expect to see some of you. Michelle's doing some videos, um, some workout stuff. She's doing like pick play videos and stuff. But um, your pictures that you post of your uh, workouts and stuff are great. Now think about doing like a little one or two minute video with that, with that instead of a picture once in a while. And that's something you're going to learn on the new team training page that Julie and Bonnie and I are working with you on. <clears throat> so our next thing we're going to talk about is how do you sell that on demand challenge pack? How do you sell that? Well, you sell it like you would any other challenge pack. You, you know, the, the best way to sell a challenge pack is 
to talk about the value of a challenge pack. The number one value of a challenge pack is that you get the nutrition coupled with the workout program. I always talk about the nutrition first because if I talk about Shakeology first and then throw the program in for a big discount, it makes more sense to the person you're talking about that they're getting a good deal because they work together. They are designed to work together. So that's my big thing that I talk about when I'm trying to talk to people about challenge packs. <clears throat> I want each one of you guys to tell me something that you would say that would add value to a challenge pack. So I'm going to unmute the first person that waves their hand at me. Don, I can't see you. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to unmute Don because I can't see her. Don, go ahead, girl. Um, <clears throat> there you are. Okay. So I need to come up with one way of selling it to them, correct? One way of selling that challenge pack. What, what value do you put on that challenge pack? Because the best way to sell a challenge pack is, val is to tell them about the value because it makes more sense to buy a challenge pack. Okay. I look at the challenge pack as though it has all the tools you need to reach the goals that you're wanting with that. Um, not only the nutrition, but it has, with the nutrition, you've got your meal plans, you've got your videos, your workouts, and your support group. It's everything tied into one. So, therefore, you don't get that if you go to Walmart and buy a workout. DVD, you just get that DVD and you have no other support to help you succeed. Yeah. So you get your free coach. You get a free coach with that. So, um, so thanks, Don. That was good. One thing I want to say about that is some of some coaches have trouble selling challenge packs, but they can sell the heck out of a program. So Andrea's like, me. So I'm going to unmute Andrea because I want her to talk about that a little bit because we're going to solve your problem tonight, right now. <laughs> Great. <laughs> Nothing like being on the spot. Thanks, yeah, Shannon. Baby. But you've sold no, like so 17 21 day fix. Sorry. Pro you've oh, sold like 17 21 day fix programs, but no chance. Yeah. Right. Yeah. So I'm selling the heck out of 21 day fix. Like every day I'm adding people left and right. Um, but nobody wants to buy the challenge pack. Well, I've sold one. And it's like, they look at the program for $59 and then they look at the challenge pack for 140 and they're like, Oh my God, no, I just want, I just want the program. I don't need Shakeology. And you know me, you know, I don't, a lot of you don't know me, but I'm really big on nutrition. It's one of the biggest um, things that I believe in and I believe in coupling it with, you know, you have to have it or you're not going to be successful. Right. And so I'm struggling with, getting them to buy into that, which blows my mind, but yeah, I need help. <laughs> because you are, you're really the nutrition guru, you know, you really, you really are. So it's, let me, yeah. I'm going to unmute Lindsay right now too, because I want Lindsay to tell us what value she would put on a challenge pack. Um, mostly, uh, what I've learned, um, in the past, I have, uh, people who buy the challenge packs and then people who just buy the programs and then they see everybody in the accountability group talking about Shakeology and they're like, well, maybe I should have bought this. So I just let them know from the get go. Look, I mean, I understand that the cost is, is a little more expensive, but ideally you combining them, you're going to save more money. I said, because in two, two or three weeks, you're going to want Shakeology. You're just going to want it. You want to know what the buzz is. I'm like, so you might as well get it now, get a head start on it. Cause I mean, there's no point in waiting three weeks. I mean, if you're ready to commit to the program now, why are you not committing to the nutrition part of it as well? And they're usually like, oh, well, yeah, you're probably right. And I'm like, of course I'm right. <laughs> of course I, yeah, I, well, obviously. Yeah, so. that's perfect. But so, and then you also tell them, you know, it's, it's $4 a day. Right. You know, yeah. All the girls who drink coffee and, and do all that stuff every day, this is four bucks a day. I mean, it's yeah. not going to break you. And I just had that discussion with somebody. I just taught body combat and I had a discussion with a woman um, in my class after that who said, I want to try Shakeology. I've got a class reunion coming up. Well, she's already got her why. Why does she want Shakeology? And so um, my goal is to sell her the on-demand challenge pack. She wants Shakeology and she comes to combat whenever she can. But I'm assuming that sh her husband would actually work out with her if they had it on demand wherever they are at home, whatever. So um, I'm also going to talk to her about 
how when you buy Shakeology, you can get the on-demand for $10 more. And then next month, they're going to charge you your 90 days, and then you don't have to pay again for 90 days. But you also avoid the shipping charges when you do it like that. If you're just going to buy the program, you're going to get charged shipping. When you buy the challenge pack, you don't have shipping charges. And then when your Shakeology comes again, it's only $2 shipping. Um, and I don't know anybody that doesn't get addicted to Shakeology. So I know, I mean, there are people that say, oh, I just can't afford it this month. Um, if people tell me that, I, I usually ask them, let's go over your grocery budget. What are you buying right now? That, or, or what came up? What, what came up in your family that you can't afford Shakeology this month and let's figure it out. And if we can't figure it out, I ask them to, to freeze their Shakeology for a month and then start getting it again, which they usually do. Or um, we talk about how, um, oh gosh, it just went out of my head what I was gonna say. Well, anyway, um, so freezing the, the account, freezing the Shakeology for a month is fine. Then, then they're gonna get it again. And that usually works for them. Um, so now let's go, Michelle. Let's go to Michelle. Go ahead, Dave. Go ahead, Dave. Um, when I sell my challenge packs, I usually put more emphasis on Shakeology. Um, I usually tell them that it'll save them more money on groceries and that they will get um, results faster by incorporating this into their diet. And usually, most of the time, it works and they yeah. usually go for it. Yeah, you're exactly right, Michelle. You get, if you have your nutrition coupled with your workout, that is where the results come in. That's, that's when the people in those 21 day fix groups, the people that are on Shakeology get a lot better results than the people that aren't on Shakeology. And I think we've all seen that in our challenge groups as well. Um, so it's just, it's the way you approach it. Um, approaching the nutrition side of it first, especially for Andrea, approaching the nutrition side of it first, say, and then the, um, the program is at a discount, you know, that's okay, Kim, no big deal. Um, I think that's huge. I think that's huge. I think it's huge that you save shipping. I think it's huge that, um, you, you start using Shakeology and it makes changes from the inside out. All right. So Andrea, does that help you with the challenge pack? I like how to talk about them. Yeah, yeah, it does, um, definitely. And I like, I like the aspect of telling them how they're going to save money rather than spend money. So, yeah. yeah that's what you and it you. is true. And those people that, that want to continue on Shakeology, talk to them about signing up as a discount coach. Right. A buyer. That, ha that works for me a lot, and it, it works because it makes sense. Why would somebody spend $130 on Shakeology when they could spend 97 plus taxes, 105 in Iowa? So why would you spend like $30 more than that? I don't, I don't get it. So it's, it's a good deal. It's a super good deal. All right. So going on, moving ahead. And Kim, the only thing you missed was us talking about how to sell challenge packs right now. Because I, I wanted to talk about the on-demand challenge pack. So the next thing I want to talk about to you guys is um, it's proven over and over again that if we focus on certain challenge packs or certain sales as a team, as a whole, our volume and our sales as a team and individually is higher every month and we all reach success club. All right. Hey, you made it. Woo, Laura made it. How are you? Good. All right. So. Um, when, um, when we do that, like I said, everybody's team volume sales and, uh, as a group, our team volume is higher. So this month for our team, I usually try to focus on the challenge packs that are the specials of the month. And you can do that as well, but I've chosen three different things that I think we should focus on this month. It's the on-demand challenge pack. Of course, it is the three day refresh challenge pack. And it is the 21 day fix and 21 day fix extreme. And not only focus on those challenge packs, but the kickstart packs, because that's what Andrea just sell, sold a kickstart pack. She signed up a coach with a kickstart pack. What the heck? That's the, that's the best deal all around. You get three day refresh, you get your, your nutrition or psychology and you get your program. Um, that should be a fairly easy sell, especially when those things are on, on special because everything works together 
to help people reach their goals. And once they do it, they see that happening. So it's pretty cool. So if you guys take some notes, I know I'm recording this, but take some notes. So as a team, if we focus on those challenge packs this month, you're going to see that as a whole and individually, everything's going to boost. All the team volume will boost. And we're going to try to do that every month. We did it in February and our team volume was like out the roof. So we're going to just try to keep doing that. So on demand, three day refresh and the 221 day fixed challenge packs. Focus on those this week, this month and watch your sales go crazy. All right. Let me look at my notes, you guys. Hang on. And da -da -da -da. I'm so excited that you guys are on this call tonight. It really shows that you uh, that you care about your business and that you care about everybody else around you. You care about the other coaches and you care about the people that you're trying to help. All right. Next, I've got details of upcoming dates. So um, Don's coach webinar, his coach, coach opportunity to webinar is Wednesday the 18th. So it's a week from today and it's at two different times. If you're on the East Coast, if you have Eastern time, which is probably on this call, just Laura, it's at 1215 in the afternoon and 815 at night. And the rest of us in Iowa and Texas, it is at 1115 a.m. and 715 p.m. I made an event. So you can invite people. It's a little bit, I, to me, it's a little bit easier to have an event to invite people. And then there's a link there that they can click on to register. So I put that on our team page. I put it on Team Synergy page. So you can just uh, go to that page, invite people. You can post on there if you like. All right. Next, Super Saturday is April 25th. And yes, I've had a couple people ask, am I going to host that Super Saturday again? Yes, I will. So you guys can come out. I'll, I'll sign up for it now. So Michelle, Kim, and uh, Lindsay are all here. And Dawn will all, will all be able to go. And what the heck, Laura, just drive on down. Andrea, just drive on up. <laughs> that'd be awesome, wouldn't it? Oh, my God. That'd be fun. Okay. Now, um, the changes that are being made for the... Um, customer lead program. It's, uh, it's, they need to make these changes because we are growing so big. We have so many coaches that there's not quite enough customer leads maybe to go around. They want to make sure everybody gets customer leads. So right now, um, if you're Emerald, you start getting customer leads, right? Now you have to be success club five. You also have to be Success Club 5 as an Emerald to get a customer lead. And some of your guys are going, oh, well, hardly any of my customer leads answer me back anyway. That doesn't matter. Keep talking to them. Keep uh, following up with them. Because one of these days, they're going to they're gonna talk back to you. Most of them will respond at some point. One, of, one or two of mine have signed up as coaches. So it really does work. It really does work if you follow up with them. Um, and S uh, SC5 is what you want to do anyway. So you guys, make yourselves reach S Success Club 5. You guys have all done it before. You guys have gone way over Success Club 5 before. To get yourself a lead, um, a Success Club lead. S right, yes. So it's, yes, it's a it's SC5, Kim, SC5. If you want to get a success club lead, now the difference between the two lead, success club lead is someone that's already purchased like Shakeology on Home Direct. So those leads you don't get any points for, but you get commission every month from that Home Direct. You have to have success club 10 to get a success club lead. But to get a regular customer lead, you just have to have success club five, between success club five and 10, which you can all do. I have no doubt you can all do that. And, um, you know, if, if you're worried about it or you're like, gosh, I don't even know how to, how to do this, just, just please message me and we'll have a one-on-one -on -one about it because it's really not hard to get success club five. I am sitting at zero right now telling you guys it's not hard, but I'm just sitting at zero yeah, right now, which is, it's not going to last because I've got people on the line for coaching and, and uh, challenge packs and HD orders. So we'll, um, We'll make that happen as the month goes on. And so will you, right? Don't, don't be shy. Ask me if you want help. Talk to me. I'm here to help you guys. 
All right, next. Steph's here. Yay. Um, I want to talk to you guys about your challenge groups and your free groups. Do you guys know what a virtual fitness center is? Okay, you're going to like this. Okay, this is from Julie Miller. So this is what Julie does, and this is something that I want to start doing, and I think you guys will want to start doing too. And it's really, really fun, and it's a really good way to um, at least get your Shakeology sales going. So you've got a free seven-day group. All right. Try to think of your, your free groups as being either one week, two weeks, or three to three weeks. I don't think a month and I don't think 60 days. I think that's too long for a free groups. It's way too long. But a seven day free group is perfect. All right. Um, I have a format for a seven day clean eating group. It's a really good format. And at the end of that seven day clean eating group, we would move everyone over to a virtual fitness center. So in that fitness center, it's, it's sort of like um, coaches go in there to get more success. So they're going into the gym now. So they're going from this free clean eating group into a gym. In that gym, we, we uh, uh, do a Shakeology group. All right. And they can do whatever workouts they want, whatever workouts they want. Eventually, some of those people can move into coaching or they can move into um, a challenge group. But what um, what Julie did and what really works well for her is she went from a clean eating group, seven day clean eating group. She does it the first week of every month. And those people move into weight loss with Shakeology by Julie. Um, maybe not the most creative title, but. It tells you what it is, and it's very successful for her on selling Shakeology and getting people on Shakeology and signing up coaches. So um, shake your head if you want to see it. Want to see it? I'll show. Okay, I'm going to do a little screen share here. Let me do it. I'll show you that page. I'm a fly on the wall on Julie's page there, so hang on. Here's my page. Can you guys all see this okay? Yep, okay. All right, Julie's Weight Management with Shakeology. This is her group, all right? And all of these people now are on Shakeology. All these people are on Shakeology, and they went from this seven-day clean eating group to this group. This is the first week of this particular group. So uh, this is a Shakeology, weight loss with Shakeology, and she's having really good success with the people losing weight and talking to her about what to do for their their fitness right now. Um, from this group, she's gotten people on demand, challenge pack sold. So I think that's pretty cool. So anyway, stop share. That's, it's just another group, but it, but it's called, she calls it her virtual fitness center. If you want to do it, be creative, be creative. You don't have to use what, what she used. You can do whatever you want. Um, a virtual fitness center can be an on demand group. But you've got to transition from a seven-day group into that next level. And then if you want to transition them into the next level, those are the people that want to be in a challenge group, specific challenge group, or become coaches. Do you got, does that make sense to you guys? Yeah? Okay, good. Okay, let me look at this. On her Shakeology group, what are the rules? Yes. Exactly. They, they have Shakeology and they have it once a day. That's the rule. And they can, they can, um, they keep following the clean eating patterns, but they have one Shakeology a day. Um, and that's the rule. They have one meal a day of Shakeology, but they're still posting on their, their weight loss. They're still posting what the workouts are, what workouts are doing. And they're posting on what they're eating, their recipes. So it's a really actually a good fun group. Uh, let me see. Yes, exactly, Kim. Kim says, uh, so should we so check with your people in your free groups and ask them if they want to move and transition into a virtual fitness center group. Yes, like to your reinvent page. Because you're yes, exactly, Kim. Perfect. Yes, and I'll help you guys with that. If you want help with that, that's why I'm here. Um so what um I hopefully that made sense to you guys. I want it to make sense. I don't want it to be like just going over it really fast and you guys are going, oh, I don't know what that was. But um, really, and once again, reach out to me, message me if you don't know what I was just talking about. And um, I will go over it with you like piece by piece 
it's a really cool way to transition and it's a really cool way to get some HD Shakeology orders and get people on that track. I love seeing people on Shakeology that come to me and say, oh my God, my hair is growing so thick right now. And or my fingernails, I can't keep them, I can't keep them trimmed or whatever. So, uh, and there's, my skin is great. And it is a good, it also is a good way to transition out of a challenge group too, exactly. That way they're always engaged. You have these people always engaged and always rolling. So um, those are the people that actually become coaches, those people that stay with you through those groups and never, ever, ever be afraid to talk to them about coaching. All of you guys are on the, um, the training page that Bonnie and Julie and I are running. So tomorrow I'm going to be uh, the speaker tomorrow and I'm going to be talking on that page about the three types of coaches. And there's also a fourth type of coach. And that's the coach that is afraid to announce that they're a coach. They just kind of hang back and they, they don't really do the three vital behaviors. They're afraid people are going to think all you're trying to do is sell, 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 sell. So, um, we call, we call that a closet coach and I don't have that in my, um, in my little spiel tomorrow, but I am going to post about it tomorrow. I don't have that in my video, but I know we've all seen them. We all have them in our, on our teams, but those are the people that you want to help. You want to explain to them why this is going to benefit other people and why it's sharing. It is sharing. I can't even, I can't even imagine just walking up to somebody and say, um, here, try this. You know, you've got to share something. You got to talk about it and you've got to say why it helped you and what it did for you. All right, guys. So I'm going to open this up to questions real quick. And then I want to read a little personal development to you guys from Jim Rohn, because I think he's just magnificent. He's just a wonderful, wonderful guy. So unmute everybody and um, please raise your hand with questions. Shout out. Is there a challenge group guide to the beach body on demand, like a series of workouts that they can do? Yeah, I'll show. Let's go to the back office. Let's take a look. Hang on. Good question. <laughs> Get on my bus and ride over there with me, guys. Come on. All right. So we're going to sail. Look at that zero. I don't like seeing that zero there. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like mine right now. <laughs> It'll change in a day or two. <clears throat> All right, I'm just waiting. Just waiting. Here we go. I'm just dancing. Just dancing. That's what that made me think of, Andrea. Just dancing. Yeah. All right, so we are in the back office at Business Tools. So I went under Sales and Marketing, then I just went to Business Tools. All right, so Beach Body Challenge Group Guides, right there. Okay, keep looking. Keep looking. La la. Where is it? Multi pro, there's a multi program group if you guys ever need that. Oh, I know it's here somewhere. Oh, I'm not seeing it. So I'm gonna go. So I'm there it is, Shannon. I see it over on the left. On the left, over here. Go down. On there it head. is. Oh, Team Beach Body Club. That's what I was trying to find it. So Team Beach Body Club. I forgot what they called it. So you click on that. You've got your product training and education, talking points, challenge group guide, you guys, ta-da, right there. So you can do, there's your coach starter guide. That's for you to look at. Participant starter guide, that's the first thing you always post in your challenge group. And there's your weekly coaching guide, which always starts at week zero. Challenge guides start with the week before the challenge group actually begins. All right, so then you've got some marketing tools here too. Sample email. There's a, the, for those of you that were talking about um, sending out emails and e-cards to your customers, there are sample email templates here and the e-cards are right here as well. Okay. When you send this out, make sure you send out the challenge pack e-card because that's what you wanna focus on first. The regular e-card just talks about becoming um, becoming a team club member so you can get the on demand all right so we're just going to go here and really you don't see it here you're going to have to go to fitness programs click 
and you don't see it, right? But you got to scroll because it's here. There it is, Club and Shakeology, right there. There's the challenge pack. So I'm not even sure where the other one is because I always just use the challenge pack one. I've sent it out twice now. And today I just sent out an email to all my customers just announcing that, you know, wh what advantages there, there are to becoming a club member. There are tons of advantages to becoming a club member. There are lots of tools on Beachbody that they'll be able to use that they can't use if they're not a club member. So did that help you find it? Yes. I'll get out of here then. There we go. All right. Who else has any questions? Anybody? So Shannon, on that yeah. e club challenge pack, yeah. can I send those out to people that are like on the fence? They haven't even ordered yet. Yeah, you sure can. Yes. Um, you you can send those out. I'll tell you what, Don. If you want to add people's emails to your regular email contact list in your Beachbody back office, you can. I add people that aren't my customers in there all the time. That way I can send out stuff to them. And you and I can go okay. right back to one-on-one. -on -one. I'll show you how to do that. <clears throat> okay. Awesome. Yeah. Yeah, that would be great because I know you've got a lot of people in mind for that. <laughs> Excellent. Um, I, have a, I have a question for the group. Just I'm looking for some ideas for programs to use for marketing tools for – um, you know how people will take a really nice picture of themselves working out and then they put text and stuff. Well, I just, I have no clue where to start with that. <laughs> so does anybody have any advice on programs or apps that are out there that help with these kind of sexy looking marketing tools? So are you talking about for your phone or for your computer or both? Uh, both, mostly for uh, posting on my Facebook or in my challenge groups. Do you want to take, but do you want a, an app for your phone to make pictures like that? Or do you want it for your computer? Um, I think for my phone. Laura Wood, speak up, my dear. Yeah, yeah actually, I, I have been watching you. <laughs> yeah. I, okay, I have a couple things. It's, I don't know if you can see it. Pixart, P-I-C-S-A-R-T. I don't know if you can see it. That's one that I use. I'm on a Droid though, so I'm not on an iPhone. So if you're on an iPhone, I heard the one to use is is Pick Monkey. I'm on a Droid, so okay. Um, so I I Pixart P I C S A R T. It looks like okay. a camera and has a P. And that one I like because you can take your pictures with your regular camera and then you can bring it in and you can filter it. And then when you type the the words, it goes right on top of your picture. And you can change the font. So I like that. Um, Photo Grid is the other one I use. I use that one first. And that one you can put like multiple pictures next to each other. But you the words go on top. So sometimes I have to do PixArt first and then I import it to Photo Grid. But the thing about Photo Grid is it'll take your pictures and it'll shrink it for Instagram. Oh, cool. Yeah. So, um, and I think, I think it actually... I downloaded another app for it, but PhotoGrid has a thing that you can fix it so it shrinks it, and then so you get like a black on top and a black on the bottom, but it fits it in for Instagram. Cool. Um, and yeah. then uh, Pick Play Post I also use, which is you can do pictures and videos. It's a little temperamental. It only lets you do like a minute of video, I but you can that. have so, multiple – windows and do that so you have your but I would do like I'll have to use PixArt first to do my words on top of my picture and then import it into pick play post so those I use I see now uh, pick, I use pick monkey um, I use pick monkey on my computer to make like uh, collage pictures and things and uh, it's PIC monkey and then I also use Picasa PIC ASA Picasa um, and then you can you can sort of make a, a collage of scattered pictures, like a dream board, which is a, a vision board, which is great. I think I got that from you, Kim. That yeah, I used that for mine, but I haven't done it for anything else, so I should explore. It's really fun to use. Yeah, that's a really fun one to use. Um, but I do mine all on my phone. I don't do anything on the laptop. Yours are no. awesome, Laura. Yours are just so that's fun. That's great to know. And, yeah. and I use uh, my camera. There's a... Um, a d delay feature too, so you can do the timer. So you go in, I use my regular camera on the phone, and then I go in the settings and I 
push the star and I can delay it five seconds or 10 seconds until I, you know, so I get in position. So it's not like somebody else is taking the picture, even though it looks like it. Yeah. Great. Yeah, they look great. Thank yeah, you. They do. So but, I, didn't, I didn't under, I didn't really um, realize that you could take the picture, do it in PixArt and then move it to uh, PicMonkey and, and, or uh, yeah, you can, yeah. Photo. Cause you just, cause it's like in your camera. Yeah. So you cool. have to go get it import it in mm -hmm. excellent looks look steph's making us dinner you guys mm. Mm, yeah. it, steph. <laughs> and the oh, other man. thing i'm doing is i i decided to make a time lapse video as part of my own accountability and then it'll be marketing so i've been taking pictures i'm going through 21 day fix again and then i'm going to go to extreme so that i can um, track my fitness level um I'm still trying to lose 10 or 12 pounds, so I figure it'll become more and more clear, and then I'll have this really neat marketing. You've probably seen them too, but I That's just was like, I gotta do that. That's so awesome. I can't wait to finish that and share yeah. it, and hopefully I can find a cool video program to. Oh my gosh, that's great, Kim. Yeah, super it's great idea. I'm motivated, because I wanna see it when it's done. That's awesome, I love that idea. Very cool. All right, you guys, Um, before we end our call, and you guys, are you pretty clear on all of the different lead program changes? Um, they're not going into effect just, just yet, but next month they will be. And pretty clear, are you clear on um, how, to, how to find value, how to talk about value of a challenge pack to your customer? Don's going to have another call about that as well, and I think we should all be on that too because he always has more insight, you know. Um, I always learn stuff from his calls. And so he'll post that when it's ready. And I want to read to you. I don't know how many of you guys like to listen to Jim Rohn for personal development or read him. I think he's just incredible. Um, this is from his book, Building Your Network Marketing Business. And if you, if you don't have anything by Jim Rohn on Audible or, or to listen to, please get some of his stuff because he's very energizing. He's, he's great. All right. So. This is, this is an excerpt from um, this book. When babies are born, they were not designed to just be carried. Babies were not born to be carried all their lives. Someday you've got to try your legs. Someday you've got to try your wings. Someday you've got to try, even if you fall down, you've got to try. Because you can't just crawl around all your life. You can't be carried all your life. So as quickly as possible, you can help a thousand people, but you can't carry three. So that means you are coach leaders. <coughs> Let your coaches spread their wings. Train them. Train your coaches. Help them spread their wings. Don't carry them. Don't carry them for two years, three years. Let them fly away and start their own team. That's, that's my take on that for us, okay? Next, don't expect a pear tree to bear apples. I used to try to change everything. Here's what I learned. You cannot change people, but they can change themselves. Incredible. Capital in your business is not what matters. It's not the money that buys you a future. It's your skills that buy you a future. Money and no skills, and I'm telling you, you're still poor. Money and no ambition, where are you? Money and no courage, you're broke. A little bit of money and a whole lot of courage is all we need. I'm looking for people and I'm recruiting back in those days and money didn't matter. What mattered to me was somebody's willingness, somebody's ingenuity, somebody's willingness to try. If they had a dollar to invest, that was plenty for me. A dollar and some ambition and I can show you how to get rich and it'll be one of the classic stories of this company. I've got to go recruit somebody. I go out and recruit somebody and they say, I don't have any money. You say, I've been looking for you for six months. Let me show you how to do it without any money. Because here's the rules of capitalism. Now jot this down. You can either buy and sell or if you're in a certain circumstance, you can sell and buy. If you've got ambition. Now, if you haven't got ambition, we can't cure that. And money won't cure lack of ambition. But if you've got a dollar and some ambition, I'll show you how to get rich. 
And even if you don't have a dollar, I'll show you how to get rich because you can sell and buy. Somebody says, as soon as this product arrives, I'll sell it. Then you don't understand. You don't understand the magic of fortune. If you say, I'll have to wait until it gets here to sell it, then you probably don't understand the value of your own story. So I want you guys to think about that. Think about the value of your own story. Think about when people say, I don't have any money. What if you said to them, good, you're just the person I've been looking for. What if you said that to somebody? That might just help you out. So thanks, you guys. I'm so excited that you guys are on this call. I'm so proud of everybody on this team. You guys are rocking. And Lindsay and Andrea, I'm going to hook you guys up. Anybody else looking for more success partners? You can have two or three success partners. It's cool. All right. So I'm going to say good night. Unless you guys have something else you got to ask or talk about, please tell me. All right, Laura. I need to ask you a personal question. All right. So it's not my personal. I'm not personal. How – I'm watching you on Facebook. You are everywhere. How do you do it? You're in challenge groups. You comment on people's stuff. You're posting. How, how are you doing it? Well, as Bonnie would say, I'm really fast. <laughs> I, um, you know, I have certain things that I do every single day on Facebook. And um, I have certain places I go every single day on Facebook. And I don't deviate and start stalking people on Facebook. Um, sometimes I'll scroll down. If I, see Laura, if I see Laura Rainey Wood posted this cool picture and it's the first thing that shows up on my newsfeed, I might start scrolling down to see anything. Then I'm like, well, there's nothing here. It's just people talking about stupid things. So I, um, I stop myself, right? Mm -hmm. So um, I have... I have the first thing I do in the morning is I get on Facebook. I post in my challenge groups and I post on my team pages and I post on my get in control and get fit page. And the last place I post is my personal page. Um, and sometimes I'll post the same thing on the personal pages I do on my uh, get in control page. But that's what I mean. I, I'm very disciplined when it comes to ask Mike. I, I'm on there for a long time at certain places, certain days, certain times of the day. But I'm very focused when I'm on there. Does that help you? I think so. Okay. But you just see when I post it, if someone in any of the groups, and you must be in a lot of groups. I am. Anytime someone posts that they did their workout or whatever, you're the first one to like it. And you're just everywhere. <laughs> You I, are. I think it's just timing. A lot of that is timing because I'm on in the morning and then I have time in the afternoon and then I also have time at night because of my, my teaching and my client schedule um, that, that makes that happen for me. But mm -hmm. everybody else can do that too. Everybody else can get on first thing in the morning. Thanks, Michelle. Everybody can get on the first thing in the morning. Everybody can get on in their lunch hour. Hopefully, if you can't, it's probably because you work in a place where you can't do that, which is a lot of people mm -hmm. they can't get on at work. And everybody has a little bit of time in the evening. And I know people that have children, that's harder. I understand mm -hmm. that. However, like Kim, I, Kim makes time to do it. Kim has a family. Michelle has a family. Michelle makes time to do it. So mm -hmm. I, I think that it's, it's all in what's, what's your goal? What is your goal? My goal isn't so much rank advancement as it is to double my income. So now I'm at the point in my income where I have to do, I have to really focus on rank advancement to make more income. Does that help? Does that make sense? Yep. Okay. Yep. So I, um, I see everything that pops up in the corner. If it's something uh, in one of my groups or if it's, it's one of the things I want to do is support people in all the groups that I'm in. Even if I don't know them, I will go in and like or comment on something they just did just to support them, especially other coaches. Um, because I think that's really important. It's been helpful to me. Good. At times when, you know, things weren't, a lot of people weren't responding in different groups, you know. Yeah. It definitely yeah. has been helpful. It's like, well, somebody sees. Yeah. You yeah. Know? Right. And a lot of people in your groups will be, will just become flies on the wall and they won't engage. But there's, there are ways to get them to engage. There are ways to get them to respond and answer questions questions, posting a question and, and getting out of the challenge group guides. Kim, your reinvent page freaking rocks. Stephanie, <laughs> Stephanie's got a be fit page. 
just rocks. And and people are are talking on those pages a lot. So um, it just takes engaging the people that are on there and supporting them when they post something. Post something back. Comment back to them. And if you're lucky enough like me to be in the right place at the right time and catch all of them as they pop up, you'll notice that people are on Facebook certain times of the day. That's when I'm on Facebook. I'm, I try to make it a habit to be on Facebook 7 a.m., noon, and 7 p.m. So I try to make it a habit to be on Facebook at those times. That's when everybody's on. And you know when a big majority of people are on? Freaking 10 o'clock at night. What is that? If you haven't noticed that, because now I'll get, I'll get questions popping up right and left from people at 10 or 11 o'clock at night. I'm like, really people go to bed. I'll talk to you tomorrow, <laughs> but I'll stay up and answer them. I don't know if that helped you or not, but I hope it did. Definitely. Thank you. Good. I appreciate you. Oh, thank you. I appreciate you. And I'm so glad you're on this call. It's so nice to have thank you. you. On this call. Thank you for having me. Thank you. Well, I know some of you guys have to run. So what I'm going to do is end this call We'll stop recording, and um, Kim and I have a one-on-one -on -one right now, but if anybody needs any help, please message me, and we're going to do it. We'll get our one-on-ones going.